Now this one is a very interesting question. It says, in a survey, it shows that 63% of the people read newspaper A, whereas 76% of the people read newspaper B. If X% percent of the people read both the newspapers, what out of the given four options is a possible value of X? Classic set theory ka sawal hai. Right? Suppose A represents the set of all those people who read newspaper A. Then cardinality of A will be 63%. And let B represent the set of people who read newspaper B. So cardinality of B will be 76%. Obviously, number of members in A intersection B will be X%. percent, Right? So which formula will come into action? Yes. Number of members in A union B is number of members in A plus number of members in B minus number of members in A intersection B. Now, both these quantities we already know. But what about the other two? A equation may do quantities unknown hai, matlab max to max, hum ek range may answer de sakte hai. Right? This much is understood? So let us go back to the basics and recall a very important fact ki A union B jo hai, wo at max universal set ke barabar ho sakta hai. Usse exceed to kar nahi sakta. That means number of members in A union B will be less than or equal to number of members in the universal set, which obviously is 100%. Correct? So what are you getting? 63 plus 76 minus X will be at most 100. From there you end up getting that X is greater than or equal to 39. Matlab ki X ki value at least 39 honi chahiye. Cool? Another important fact which we are already aware of is ki Common members of A and B jo hain, unki cardinality at max kitni ho sakti hai? Minimum of the cardinality of A and B, right? That means X can be at max equal to minimum of 63 and 76, which is nothing but 63. So X at most can be 63 and it is at least equal to 39. So the range for X is the closed interval 39 to 63 which means that the possible value of x out of the given four options will be 55.